Hello and welcome to Secret Revelations. I'm Tom. This is this week's mod uh, tutorial. Um, and today I'm showing you how to use the candy mod for 1.2.5. Currently installed is a uh, mod loader and too many items and obviously the candy mod. So uh, let's get started. Uh, that really annoying sound of a villager using his church is annoying me. So goodbye, father. Father, whatever you want to call him. So the first step into this candy mod is to break down some, um, well first of all it's pretty much to take down some reeds uh, or sugar canes and collect the sugar from it. Um, and also then the other step is to go and kill squid and get ink uh, because you're going to need to create a few dyes. Uh, and the dyes you're going to need to create are the rose red, uh, the lapis lazuli, la lazuli and uh, the cactus green, so maybe not all the dye. So the first thing you're going to do, right click that the bit of sugar cane in the corner, rose red up here, and as you can see we'll get this. This is the food colouring sack, uh, and obviously we'll do the one for the blue one, so you get this one, and also this one. So you get three colours uh, of uh, food colouring onto uh, the next step. Okay, so step two is to create a furnace, uh, sugar at the top, lava bucket at the bottom, and we're going to get some drum roll in your mind. Music's a bit loud. There we go. And we get some caramel. Uh, now this caramel is going to come in handy for when we're going to make some awesome lollipops. So uh, I'm just going to let that do a little bit more. Okay, so now I've got four caramel. We're going to fly back up here. And uh, I'm going to create this by putting four in a square. Create this lollipop top. Uh, so we're going to make that. Also, we're going to need to create uh, using the sugar. It's this way, I think. We're going to need to grab some more of these. By putting uh, in a kind of cross formation, we're going to get a green lollipop top, a red one, and a blue one. There we go. So, lots of different lollipop tops right there. That's pretty cool. So, on to step three. Step three is pretty simple and that's actually making the lollipops. So you're going to need to grab yourself some uh, sticks, go into here, put it at the top, there we go, and uh, just underneath each other we create a caramel lollipop. We can do the same for the other three. Put that in there. Oh dear. Oopsie nosy. Oops, I just ate that one. I didn't mean to do that. I accidentally ate a caramel lollipop. Oh, I feel bad. There we go. All three lollipops. Simples. Nom. Nom, nom, nom. Next step is to create, using this specific uh, red lollipop top, we can create a candy cane. You're going to need a few more of the um, lollipop tops, red lollipop tops. Uh, and you're just going to need to position them, I think, in a kind of lollipop, lollipop sort of shape like this, there we go, there we go, a lollipop, uh, and uh, this here is a candy cane, pretty cool stuff, no I don't think you can actually eat these, not, I'm, I'm struggling to eat it, it's not working, it's not, not working, I can't eat it, Oh no! Oops. 
Okay, let's get that back. Let's get, get that crafting table back. Oh, I leave you with a stick. That's mean. Okay, so the next um, a bit we're going to do is also including this um, specific red top, but we can also use these ones as well. So uh, to create a block of candy, very bad for your teeth, simply fill up the whole uh, 3x3 grid uh, with the specific colour of candy cane tops to create a block. That says a block of caramel, but it really isn't. And you can decorate. Yay! It does look like quite like a circuit board. And then you can right click on it and eat it like cake. Wow, isn't that what you've always wanted to do? Is eat a block of candy? You can do this with all the other ki uh, all the other types, so all the other types. I wonder if you can do it with caramel. Untested so far, but I'm sure we probably can find a way to do it. Hmm. No, you can't. Well, that's disappointing. No wonder it wasn't on the crafting recipes on the Minecraft forums, which is always, as always, as always, always in the description below. Next step. So the next step is to create Skittles. Now, to create Skittles, you're going to need an apple. Hmm. I have a feeling I went past it. Hmm. Apples. Uh, apple might be on the. F no, it's never on this one. Probably was. I can't find a goddamn apple. Give me an apple. Please, I'm begging for an apple. Can't even find an apple. Quite embarrassing. Come on. Apple. There it is. So, get an apple, crafting table, put the apple in the middle, sugar all the way around it, it gives you skittles. There you go. Now there is another way to do it, or it gives you something different. You're going to need the um, brown sort of uh, the cocoa beans. There you go. Write that in the middle. Put that in the middle. Write it in the middle. It'd be strange. And do that. And it also gives you M&Ms. Oh, M&Ms. Awesome. So it gives you M&Ms and Skittles, depending on which way you do it. And that's a very slightly different graphic. And you can, if I right click, it appears that I can eat it. Awesome. Well, no it doesn't, but oh well. Now, on to crafting candy weapons. Mm-mm. I know. I know what you're feeling. And I feel that feeling. So, let's craft these babies. Let's craft them. So, uh, let's craft the ordinary pickaxe. Holy whoa. It's giving me what? What the hell? Why is it giving me a leather cap? Okay, so checking out the Minecraft forums, I did it alright. Uh, and also, now I can't even... Uh, so yeah, you just... It, it gives you a leather cap now. Which is a little odd. Uh, let's try a different weapon. Um, let's try another. Okay, let's let's do this one. This is pretty awesome. Uh, let's do that one. Ah, that works. You get a candy shovel. Let's see how well it works. Oh yeah, that works good. Let's get back onto the church. That's cool, let's think of another weapon. Uh, well, axe. Can you make a caramel axe? No. Don't be silly. Here we go, and you create an axe. Now, I don't think it actually matters which colour you use. I think you're going to get the same one anyway. So there's a candy axe. Oh, they look good. Like little bonbons. Hmm. Tasty. Uh, now, another thing uh, we can make, and that is a toffee apple. Mm, yeah. So you're going to need caramel, and you're going to need to surround. You're going to need to do this. Like this. Oh god, I've got to get another apple. 
No, I think I've just lost all of my... No, I haven't. Good. Apple in the middle, and then a stick. <gasps> no way. My bad. You're supposed to not use caramel. Well, no, you are. You've got to use this kind of caramel. The, the, un, the un-lollipop topped caramel. Like that. Easy mistake to make. Many people have commented on the forums about this mistake. And I for one. There we go. That looks so cool. Mm-mm, tasty. Oh, and I ate it. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. This is Secret Revelations. I'm Tom. This was the candy mod. Link in the description as always. Uh, I'm just checking. I've covered everything. Yes, I think I have. Thank you for watching. Sorry for the stop-start video. It was a very rushed video because I haven't put out a video in some time. Um, and also I have a bit of free time on my hand so I can actually play with it a bit. Uh, so, yes, thank you for watching. Um, next episode of Light and Blade is coming uh, sometime after the 20th of April. Um, reasons being is we haven't really got any special guests. Um, or they're all busy, so that's another thing. Uh, so, thank you for watching. Please uh, go and check out my uh, very personal YouTube channel, Mostly Gaming. Um, well, actually, no, it is all gaming. Uh, and that is youtube.com forward slash going too far. My blog, which also has a bit of this project on it, um, just telling you about the behind the scenes stuff, g2f.netai.net uh, slash project, and that will take you straight to the uh, Secret Revelations page on my site. Thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen. See you next time.